It's Tunnel TV. Don't forget to like, subscribe. We have my guy, the Nigerian Englishman in the building. He's finished. 4 0 to Arsenal. My guy, what are your thoughts, man? Oh, yeah, now, my people, my people. It's all about Starboy. He kicked us off today. They talked about him being injured. To be honest, I'm scared. I don't like the overload he's getting, but when he plays, he's effective. Scored a goal, won a penalty as well. Great, great performance by the, everyone in the team, to be honest. And the man that everyone's been asking for, he's been in all the, the press conferences, they've been asking him questions in all the vlogs and on social media, they've been attacking him. But finally, he breaks his Arsenal duck. Kai Havertz, the Suki German. Yeah. Mm. Talking about Kai Havertz, uh, what do you think about his game today, actually, overall? Do you I know he got his goal today. Do you know what? Like, he actually, he actually played well today. Like, I wouldn't say... I'm overly impressed with him, but he did well. Every, he won a lot of duels. He was tracking back. He conceded a foul when he, we needed, his team needed him to concede the foul. And he st st stuck that penalty away so inquisitively. So I hope it's going to be good confidence building for the boy. I hope he can push on now. Maybe he gets a start against Lons in the Champions League this week. And hopefully he can push on. I'm not one of the people that said they could see what Arsene, um, Arteta saw in this guy. I still have a lot to see in his performance, but... Well, there's something there. about him because obviously he's a German international and he still gets mm. picked for the German team. So there must be something about him. And uh, But you have a game next week. Let's talk about next week. Uh, what... I don't want to talk about next week yet, bro. 4-0 okay. to Arsenal today. No, are we talk... okay. Why are we always talking about the next chapter with Arsenal? No, Let me just live in the moment. 4-0 today, away from home. Clean sheet. After they talked about, oh, this is going to be a lot of pressure for Arsenal this game after drawing the North London derby. Away from home, I don't know why. this season, Since last season, we're more clinical and more composed as a defensive unit away from home. And we showed again today, 4-0 victory, right back in the team, and you saw what happened to the midfield. So, yeah. I enjoyed so, today. Your midfield looked like it was solid, uh, but though you're playing on that, but you guys actually look very solid going forward. Um, so that's why I was trying to bring uh, bring up uh, the game next week because obviously Man City lost today. So, it did. I mean, are you guys confident going into that game? First of all, I would like to say it's not easy to go the whole season without losing a game, Man City. Proven again, unbeaten record, still in existence for another season. But that being said, Man City are a juggernaut. Everyone was shocked for them to drop points today. But obviously with our result, their result, and how we've dropped points already in, in home games this season, it's even more important. They don't have Rodri. Rodri, we have to win. It's a must-win game. It's a must-win game next, next week. If we draw the game, then I still think we're not title contenders because dropping points against Spurs was big in terms of the gap of points, etc. But if we want to get back into contention of the title, the title race, we have to beat them. I'm not saying we will, but we have to. Where are you going to finish this season? We're going to push City all the way, but I can't see anyone other than City win the league at this stage. Then ask me again this time next week, and maybe it'll be a different answer. Nigerian Englishman, my guy, congratulations. Appreciate it.